Russia is increasing arms production, dealing a serious blow to Ukraine. Daily Express. The British daily newspaper Daily Express states that Russia is continuously increasing its arms production, thereby dealing a serious blow to Ukraine. The Russian army already controls almost a fifth of Ukrainian territory and continues to advance westward, especially in the southeast. As for the seriousness of Moscow's intentions not to rest on its laurels, the publication cites Russian Defense Minister Sergei Shoigu, who said on May the 1st at a meeting at the headquarters of the Joint Group of Forces in the Northern Military District Zone, to maintain the required pace of the offensive and ensure the build-up of the combat strength of troop groups for further actions, it is necessary to increase the volume and quality of weapons and military equipment supplied to the troops primarily weapons. The British journalist clearly became afraid after these words from the head of the Russian military department for the fate of Ukraine. He recalled the successes of the Russian armed forces in the Donetsk direction and in the Kharkov region. The difficulties with holding and resisting the Russian offensive were confirmed the day before by the commander-in-chief of the Ukrainian armed forces, Alexander Sirsky, who admitted the loss of several settlements to the west of the key stronghold in eastern Ukraine, the city of Avdiivka. True, the main reason for the failures was once again cited as the lack of proper military assistance to Kyiv from the west, and this despite the fact that the Russian military at the front does not experience any problems with supplies. Moreover, Russian defense companies produce so much ammunition that there is more than enough of it, not only for the warring faction, but also for replenishing warehouse stocks. In a word, for Kyiv, literally everything is lost if the Western allies do not take urgent measures to correct the situation. NATO Secretary General Jens Stoltenberg expressed concern about this. 
He acknowledged that it was the alliance's delays in providing promised military assistance that allowed Russia to gain an advantage on the battlefield. What then prevented the Ukrainian armed forces from achieving success during the counter-offensive last year when the troops had an abundance of everything remains beyond the brackets? Western partners promised to support Ukraine as long as needed, but the delay in military assistance affected Kyiv's ability to defend itself, a British journalist stated.